Chapter 14 of Fight Club by Chuck Palahniuk delves deep into the complexities surrounding the relationship between the narrator and Marla Singer, while simultaneously juxtaposing the personal turmoil they face with the broader unraveling of the narrator's world through the activities of Fight Club and its offshoot, Project Mayhem. The chapter begins with a deeply personal moment between the narrator and Marla. During a breast exam, they discover a second lump in Marla's breast, a grim echo of the first lump they had encountered. This moment serves not just as a reminder of Marla's ongoing battle with her health and her mortality, but also brings to light her approach towards life and death. Previously, after discovering the first lump, Marla's reaction was one of Denial and retreat. She visited a clinic, but was overwhelmed by the sight of terminally ill children and their mothers awaiting treatment. This led her to a resolution that if death was imminent, she would rather remain ignorant of it. It is in pursuit of this oblivion that Marla immerses herself in support groups for various ailments and conditions, a path that eventually crosses with that of the narrator. Amidst this personal crisis, the narrative shifts to a more external conflict. A police detective begins to call the house on Paper Street, inquiring about the explosion that destroyed the narrator's condominium. The detective informs the narrator that the explosion was caused by homemade dynamite, planting seeds of suspicion towards the narrator's involvement. Despite the detective's probing, the narrator denies any responsibility, claiming a deep attachment to his lost condominium, which he describes as his whole life. Yet the detective's skepticism is palpable, and he warns the narrator not to leave town, indicating that the authorities are closely monitoring his actions. Chapter 14. Through these two divergent yet interconnected storylines, highlights the themes of detachment and denial that run through the novel. The narrator's denial of his role in the condominium explosion reflects his broader denial of his own identity and the reality of his existence. Similarly, Marla's reaction to her health issues mirrors her overall approach to life, choosing to escape into the anonymity of support groups rather than confront her problems. Both characters, in their ways, are fighting against the inevitable, seeking control in a world that seems increasingly chaotic and out of their control. The juxtaposition of personal and external conflicts in this chapter encapsulates the essence of Fight Club, delving into the disintegration of the self amidst the quest for meaning in modern life. So what did you think about this video? Please leave a comment down below and let me know what books you would like to see in the next video. Signing off. This has been another Bookley Crash Course.